first official day of practice in the books. How's it feel? Feels great. Feels great. We got a long way to go, but it's um, it's exciting. You know, we, we had a kind of saying at Penn State, Villanova, it's like Christmas morning for us, right? So, you know, we've been waiting a long time. We've been on, these guys have been busting their butts since May 30th, right? And then they got a little time off in August, but, you know, now it's it, it's really ramped up. Um, you know, practices are much longer, much more physical, you know, instead of two or three, one hour to 105, one and a half hour max, now they're three hour long practices or two and a half, and they're stringing days together, so um, it's exciting stuff though, I think everybody in our program is really excited and, and looking forward to tomorrow. Yeah, obviously you lost two big key players, yeah. Darius and Khalid. Um, more so than points, where are you looking for to get that leadership on this year? Yeah, I mean, it's hard when you have guys like Patrick Kelly who are older and, and been in around me for a long time and Oslav Nowitzki and Khalid and, and Darius got a lot of older guys um, who kind of had a, a maturity about them. They came in, they got their work done, kind of a routine of greatness like a pro does, and then you know they would keep it moving. We got a lot of talent out here, but a lot of younger guys that kind of you know pick things up pretty quickly because we're going to be relying on them. So um, that, that's been an adjustment. Plus, you know, we had 10 practices in the summer last year because we had a foreign tour. Well, we didn't have those this year. So we're catching up a little bit. But leadership is important. <laughs> um, and, and I think guys like Kyle Rose, Antrell Charlton, Will Richardson has really stepped up and, and they've been doing a great job through the preseason. Did a great job today in the first day. But that's going to be something we're going to have to continue to develop throughout. Now, you got a bunch of new guys in the team this year, too. Who, what are some of the, who are some of the new guys you should be looking at who have impressed you so far? Well, you know what? Pretty much everybody, quite honestly. I mean, we have so much depth and, and a lot of guys who played some last year and and made some contributions, but they need to be much more consistent and, and reliable this year. Guys like Elijah Gray are going to be huge for us, and Ramad Dean, and Angel Montez is now healthy and playing, and, you know, guys like Noah Best, who was a redshirt last year, he's been great in the preseason. And naturally, you have your your your, your transfers, Jeff Favendor, who is fantastic, just lightning with the ball in his hands, really mature as well. Um, Yole has brought some great energy, and Josh Rivera is, is really a high-level athlete who can do a little bit of everything on the floor. Um, and then, you know, Jameer Tripp, who's a freshman for us, is, is kind of like uh, the bigger, younger version of Antrell Charlton, more of a Swiss Army knife. He can play every position on the floor, um, really high IQ, but needs to get in much better shape like most freshmen. <laughs> Great. Thanks, Coach. Thank you.